okay so here we need to find the integral value of c from 0 to pi of sine cube x into 1 plus 2 times cos x into 1 plus cos x whole square dx okay so we need to find the value of this integral so here we have a cos term here we have a cos term so if we can try to figure out and convert it into cos so we can do the substitution necessary substitution and try so sin cube x so if i split it into sin square x into sin x means two powers here and one power here and rest all same one plus two cos x plus one plus sorry this is multiplication so multiplied by 1 plus cos x whole square dx now if i can con i can convert it sin square into cos square so this is 1 minus cos square x since sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1 so and 1 plus 2 times cos x into 1 plus cos x squared into the sin x into dx so um, i have just taken this sin uh, sin x here and rest all are same now i have all the cos terms here so this is a cos term this is cos this is cos and its derivative is sin which is here also so if i make the necessary substitution i can transform this integral so if i just substitute sin x as some t so i will get sorry if i just substitute cos x equals t because i have cos x here so i will get sin x dx equals dt with the negative sign because derivative of cos x is minus sin x so what will i get and also changing the limits so whenever x is 0 so if you put x equals 0 here you will get cos 0 that is 1 so t equals 1 so change of limit and if x equals pi then t equals so cos pi is minus 1 so it will be minus of 1 okay so from 1 to minus 1 from 1 to minus 1 1 minus cos has become now t so it is 1 minus t square 1 plus 2t 1 plus t whole square into sin x dx has become minus sin dt so minus times dt now if i just reverse this because i have a negative sign outside so i can reverse this and remove this negative sign means from minus 1 to 1 i can integrate and this minus will become plus here and rest all i will evaluate and minus 1 minus t square so i will just open the brackets now here first opening this bracket 1 plus t square plus 2t a plus b whole square okay now i will multiply this so minus 1 to 1 so multiply these two 1 into 1 1 1 into 2t 2t two then minus t square then minus 2t cube into sorry this is cube okay let me rewrite so this is minus 2 t cube into 1 plus t square plus 2t dt so just multiply here so from minus 1 to 1 if you multiply it by 1 so you will get 1 plus t square plus 2t then 2t plus 2t cube plus 2 into 2 4 t square then minus t square if you multiply then you will get minus t square minus t to the power 4 minus 2t cube then multiply this so minus 2t cube minus 2t to the power 5 and then minus 4t to the power 4 and dt so i have multiplied all the terms now i will combine so first constants only one constant is here so here i will get from minus 1 to 1 1 then combining t square terms so t square is here t square is here t square is here 
so there are only three terms out of which two cancel out so this t square and this t square will cancel out plus and a negative sign so i will be left only with 4t square so let me just highlight this next i will combine t terms so t terms are two terms are here t terms and no other so i will get plus 4t so and next i will combine cube terms so cube cube cancel out 2t cube 2t cube so i'll be left with only minus 2t cube so minus 2t cube and then fourth power so these two terms are fourth power so minus 5t to the power 4 and then minus 2t to the power 5 dt so i have i have now just integrate i will now just integrate here so integral of 1 is t with respect to t is t plus 4 into power raised so t square will become t3 and this power will be in denominator also plus so this is 4t to the power 1 so i will use the same trick 4t to the power 2 and this power will come here minus 2 now this is t to the power 3 so i will write t to the power 4 divided by 4 minus 5 t to the power 5 divided by 5 and there you will have t to the power 6 divided by 6 and just need to put the values minus 1 and 1 so what if i put 1 here so i will get 1 plus 4 by 3 plus 4 by 2 in place of t i'll put 1 here minus 2 by 4 minus 5 by okay so this was 5 so if I cancel, I'll get minus one here. So let me rewrite. So minus one, minus two by six. I'm putting just t equals one. With a negative sign, now I put t equals minus one. So what if you put t equals minus one? So t equals minus one, you get minus one. Minus one cubed is minus one. So minus four by three. Minus one squared is 1 so 4 by 2 minus minus 1 4 is same minus 1 to the power 5 is minus 1 and you have a negative sign here so plus 1 minus 1 power 6 is same as 1 so minus 2 by 6 so just open the brackets 1 and 1 will cancel out here so minus 1 and plus 1 will cancel out here so you will get 4 by 3 plus cancel this you will get 2 minus half minus 1 by 3 2 and 6 cancelled out and with the negative negative positive 4 by 3 negative positive and negative of 2 so 2 and 2 will cancel out minus and minus will you will get plus half 2 and 4 cancel out so these two terms will cancel out and minus minus plus 1 by 3 so this minus 1 by 3 and 1 by 3 will cancel out so what you will get 4 plus 4 8 by 3 so the final value of this integral is 8 by 3, okay?